There are times that when I'm going home, I'll, I would have to go shirtless. Oh, yes. <laughs> All right, guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Guys, wait, disclaimer I'm not a lecturer, I'm a student. Welcome back, my name is Alexander Nyako. You can just call me SRC. And as I told you guys, I'll be interviewing your favorite SRC presidential aspirants. Today, I have with me KNF, Chale, on any battalions, someone who won. Actually, I'm going to say I'm going to say my dear girl. Chale KNF, you are welcome. Thank you very much. Boss, I beg, what be your name? My name is Nana Yaobuamato. Hey, what's your name? Nana Yao. Nana Yaobuamato. Nana Yaobuamato. Boss. Hey, my name is Godwin Obusuansa. Okay. Godwin Obusuansa. And then I have the man himself. KNF, KNF. I beg, kindly do an introduction to my audience. Yes. So, good afternoon, good morning, good evening. My name is Kane Nana Francis. Like you said earlier, you can call me KNF. I'm a friend and I'm a brother. And yes, that is the letter I'll say. Okay, so for now, I'll say then good afternoon, good morning, good evening. But Shamo, in present, future. And they become more punk out. Now, KNF, today we are going to have a very you know brief convo. My audience wants to know certain few things about you. First, he wants to sell out his candy nature, it's very, very important. Now, if you hold the way I will see a show smoggy, you know, where a cat boy and I'll just like, hey. Okay, mm -hmm. so as I was here, I'm actually, I've never, I'm not in any war. Okay. I've been, I'm, I can say I'm part of the UNRC. Okay. I've been off campus okay. since first. UNRC, too. please, yeah. what's the meaning of The Union of Non Residential. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So I've been off campus at Kote okay. first year. Oh, so okay. Now, and then, but then, mostly I come to campus. Tell it, guys, I'm more about drum, be me if you're more hard. <laughs> but I do come to campus. I've been going to Katanga, I've been going to Conti, I've been going to Conti. I mean, it's not always about Conti and Katanga. I go to Kunso, I go to every hall, okay. Africa, mm -hmm. and, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, who already programmed? Uh, which program do you um, I actually need geography and rural development. Oh, okay, geography. You said geography student. Uh, please, which level are you? I'm actually in second year. Oh, second year, Charlie, your man. This guy, you have to say, a microphone and a megaphone. Charlie, why did you do this? Ah! Which message are you preaching? Yeah. So like I always said, whenever I'm preaching my message, I say one thing that the most persistent and urgent question life will always ask you is what are you doing for others? I mean, KNOC is a large community and then right now they are bringing a paperless policy that not everyone knows about to do. But you know, I can't go to every hall, I can't go to all the hostels and like and it's like you're in a battlefield. You can't go to the farm without a catalyst. You can't go to the battlefield. So the, the, the megaphone be your what? That is my gun. That is your my gun. weapon. You is okay. okay. Because okay. in an instance where there are masses of people, I can't move to everyone. Okay. You know, so that that cause for the need, the reason why I have my gun, my megaphone with me. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Your mind, you get gun, megaphone. Anyway, let's go back. Let's go back. Um, have you held any student leadership before? No, no. Oh, I've okay. Never held but then, um, so what's your alumni? SS Ben Alcoy. Okay, I actually completed Ogwa Senior in Technical School oh, okay. from the Central Region. Yes. Oh, okay. Oh, Mr. Mekwansa Bound. Yes, I'm a really key. Really the key. Yes, yeah. Yes. Yes, yes. Anyway, anyway, guys, you're in us. You're in us. Okay, in KNF. Now, I feel we, you know, the elections. I mean, how are you seeing us? The election, I mean, actually, it's an election, and then it depends on where you are standing and how you will see. Where you are standing right now, your angle seeing the camera is different from where I'm standing, like the angle. Okay, so personally, I would say it's open. Okay, it's an election, the election is open, it's open, mm -hmm. and then provided it's an election, everybody has the ball. And it's in your court. Okay. The poll is over there, and it depends on how you are going to score your vote. So, uh, KNF SRC president elect. Elect. How how does this you know feel for you? Like, yeah. I mean, when you hear this, uh, KNF SRC president elect. Yeah, it feels good. I mean, KNF SRC president elect. Yes, I can say it's a hopeful like yeah, because I'm hoping for that. And someday it will happen. But it feels very very good. I mean, to be called the SRC president elect, then it actually means actually done something your ground to work you going to and fro talking to people okay. i mean it means you are you've ripped from what you are so we are going to have you know this discussion on his recent or let's say he did a video three months ago in fact it was an address to the KNST src president now the friend of the state the true state of the, the true state of the KNST src right now if you've not seen the video watch this snippet good day KNUST. 
My name is Kane Nana Francis, a geography student and an SRC presidential aspirant. This afternoon, my address is going to be based on two folks, welfare and security. From His Excellency's own marks, he measures leadership by legacy. What one leaves behind after his tenure of office is very significant to his success. Dated 21st of August 2022 on Twitter. And this statement will be very highly recommended for my criticism. First of all, the policy authored by Frank Ohusu led administration made the whole KNUST students aware that right after he sworn in as president of our humble institution, he's going to take care of lighting up off campus. As I speak to you, places off campus are still in darkness, as most students are still being attacked constantly. It is the same story that are being told, and, in that, and these are the same locations. You and I can attest to the fact that students' lives are being at risk off campus because of light issues. His Excellency Frank Ousu can attest to the fact that his police chaos policy was not even captured in his budget. You and I can attest to that fact. Mr. President, for my stay on campus, I've not seen any pharmacy on campus. And my question is why? The whole of law of affable students of K University is getting out of hands. And I believe that their voices need to be heard. The hula balu on hula balu man and then on a my friend on a friend my friend about he was so aggressive. I mean he made mention of the fact that things like the KNST police kiosk and like so many things that I mean we are not seeing and they were not captured in the budget. Mr. Kenneth, he didn't try that. Yes. So so can you can you you know tell us the inspiration behind the true state of KNST? So um, the presser that I did, that was to sit me, yeah, it is much actually. That was actually um, a presser that I made on the for the current KNUST SRC, not the president, but the SRC team as a whole. The presser in the presser, I actually spoke about some of the griefs of the students that our leader, our current president, decided to like the policies that he brought on board okay. during him his, his guns work, okay. and then. The reason why we went to give him the mandate and afterwards yeah. we're not hearing from him anymore. Yeah. I spoke about the KNOST pharmacy. Okay. pharmacy. I'll actually, yes, I'll actually say something. Oh. After the presser, mm -hmm. you could realize you and I can attest to the fact that there is a, a new pharmacy at the Independence. Oh, yes. okay. Yes, okay. so it's all good. I mean, came after the presser. After the presser. Nice so, one. You know, it's, it's all good. I mean, so when they feel the heat, advocacy. Okay. Okay. And that is the best I can do for okay. KNOST because okay. it's not only about Yang mobilize, let's go for gun work and stuff. This is student activism. Okay. I believe that a leader who is able to preach about democracy for the people, by the people, and of the people, okay. you should actually do it. Okay. Not actually stand somewhere and preach with okay. See, I always talk about the fact that it's not about taking microphone, okay. putting on suit and tie, okay. dressing it and getting the haircut with beautiful pair. Yeah, 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 so the, to, 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 with a nice so, perfume. Let me cut you here uh, about you know students getting attacked during examination and stuff. What do you have to say about that? Because yes, we are still you know recounting issues of did I say recounting? No, we are still counting issues of you know students getting attacked and what, what do you have to say about that? Yeah, um, actually, I believe that something must be done. Yeah. yeah, we should keep a red eye on that because mm -hmm. certain places are off campus, mostly off campus have been red flagged. Okay. Yeah, they've been tagged. Okay. This particular bomb, so okay. put you where I actually stay. Yeah. yeah. There are times that when I'm going home, I'll, I would have to go shirtless. No, yes. <laughs> Charlie, you're to go shirtless. Who? I would have to go shirtless, on Koti. Mm. But the same street that I've been working on, a student has been killed before. Mm. Because mm -hmm. so called Pashi boys attacked me. Fabra Men Famba, Shema Men So he refused. They killed him. Okay. The same should have been working on. Okay. So I actually believe that our students leaders should actually keep an eye on. So what do you think we can do to actually? Um, okay, so there's something that actually can be done. Okay. That is, I believe that when the particular individual, the student leaders were going for the portfolio, they had solutions to that. 
I want to do, I want to bring a polytan. Okay. How are you going to bring it? Okay. He had a solution to okay. that. I believe that they should go back to that and do it. So but should first revise, time, they should revise. They should revise their. Yeah. Do the right yes. Right. Because the the SLC is there. Okay. That is our mouthpiece. Okay. So you advocate. You okay. talk to them. All. These are the challenges the students are facing. Okay. Sometimes it's sad because. Nobody has ever moved to me that what are the challenges that you are facing. Okay. And if you're able to do that, you know how to go about some of these challenges. Okay. Yeah, because those are the grief of students. And so what do you have to do? Come to me. Let's talk. Let's sit and talk. Let's find our way out. Okay. Now, mm -hmm. Morale, good. About morale, about entertainment. I think these are all social gatherings. Social gatherings. I mean, what's your take on the suspension of social gatherings on campus? Yeah, I believe that the ban, uh, the, the ban should be lifted. There are times that I, I went to the process at Katanga and you could realize that it is not just the process. Yeah. process. Yeah. There are times that I, I, I go there and then you could realize that it's not just about Murah drumming and making noise and then banging. Mm -hmm. They are actually putting a message out there. Okay. If you could take a critical look at their flyers, they always put on it. There are times last two years or so, they were talking about say no to suicide. Okay. Okay. Koti does the same, they talk about critical issues, but then nobody has looked at that part of it. They only talk about the fact that they go about making noise. And, and then I believe that the ban, the ban should be lifted. Okay. A friend of mine, results was released, uh, released some time ago, that was last, last year. Okay. When his results was released, he didn't do so well, so he was so depressed, he was so worried. Nobody can seize our fundamental human right. He actually didn't know what to do, how to uh, talk to his parents. He was so depressed. He was there when he had a call. Charlie, Kunti present Omba. He was like, Charlie, my doll. Then he was like, Oh, Charlie, Charlie, keep the vibe, keep the energy. But when he went there, he forgot about everything. And then he was banging so happy. He forgot. And then that same friend I invited him to the process, advised him and told him that Charlie, this is not the end of life. Yeah. Through that, yeah. that individual, yeah. Sant Obi and Frena, what would have happened? Okay, it's okay. Enough with suicide related issues. So, Mr. Kiene, what is that singular message you are preaching to the students out there? To survive for yeah. I always say that the most persistent, like I really like this phrase a lot, because that is what Martin Luther King said. He hey, says that Martin Luther, the end of the year, free are you? You oh, have no. a mantra that you are running. Yes, on. I say Sisu. Uh huh. Now, Majesty, say Sisu. Sisu, eh? Sisu, Sisu. In the end, you are running the CR7 of KNUC politics. So, who ni ma? He says, "Ana ma ya no ma ko ene no." The CR7. You see the video that I just dropped, KNUC Mandela versus CR7. Uh huh. Mon koshe, mon koshe. Uh huh. Yes, so my mantra is Sisu. Okay. It is an extraordinary determination. The ability to turn frontiers into barriers and then the fit to finish. Um, ah, fit to finish. That's Abu Abu Okay, I can say a finished culture. I can put it in a way as a finished culture. Okay. Yeah, simply, I always say one thing that there's some good in the worst of us, there's some evil in the best of us. Times that people feel undermined, times that people ignore people, they underrate people. I understand. We are in a social environment, we all can be up there. So, I always say that. There's some good in the west of us. Those that they don't believe in us, we are doing most. And I always say that it is a groundswork. We are keeping it cool. It is but a groundswork. It is a groundswork. Can you tell us the inspiration behind your Batakari? My Batakari. Oh, okay. Actually, I'm not a Nordner. Okay. I'm not from the North. It's a branding. Not. That is my branding. Oh, okay. I mean, yeah, it is key. Okay. As, as I'm a, not, wait, to the state of Essas, the true state of Essas is not Ufran to man. Mm. Yeah, so it is a state that I'm given, okay. and then Kinte signifies a lot. Okay. Imagine a tune for coming to uh, have an address and then being in jeans and shirt. How would you feel? Okay. And I'm on a can, okay. and then the Kinte signifies it means a lot to us. So that calls for the reason behind. Okay. And then I mean, there's more research you can all do. Research All right, guys, yes. Charlie, because of time, we say come on the intimate for us, sir. But if I want to call, no. See, don't worry. One more minute, you know, interview. I'm on my notes. I'm not dropping. But KNF, let's give you 60 seconds. Talk to the students. 60 seconds of Mr. Talk to them. Why should they actually vie for KNF in this year's SLC presidential election? You have the floor. Like I said, life's most persistent and urgent question is what are you doing for others? Growing up, one thing that I always said is in all things that I will lead myself to, that is but of one ambition, that is to be of better use to my fellow men. KNUSC has existed 70 years before this young man is coming. 
I am never the Messiah. I am not a Jesus Christ. Neither am I a, a, a demigod. But I always talk about three things. The feasibility, visibility, and visibility of things. How you can be involved. How I can be involved. That particular student watching me right now. The one about to change the channel. Has an idea. But your idea is what I am interested in. Ah! This is KNF, your favorite candidate on your best YouTube channel. That is SLC TV. We are keeping you updated with everything political, media, social media, everything. If you need here, nothing goes out. We are keeping your energy active. My name is K Nana Francis, your next SLC president. My mantra is Sisu. When I say Sisu, you respond by saying Sue.